Hello, my name is Eric Schaefer and I'm a clinical lead at A Better Today Recovery Services. In this module, we'll dive deeper and discuss the disease model of addiction as well as the brain's role in the severity of the addiction. Topic 1, the disease model of addiction. Before we charge headfirst into the National Center on Addiction Diseases model of addiction, we must first briefly cover what we already know about substance abuse. The substances that are commonly abused tend to offer a euphoric feeling of well-being that influences an individual's mood, and when these substances are abused or overindulged in, the brain begins to change. We know that both legal and illegal substances can be abused thus developing an addiction or physical and mental dependency. Developing a dependency on a substance can cause negative consequences to both the body and in the person's life. This dependency is expressed in a type of behavior that negatively impacts the way they view themselves, others, and life in general. This is a good foundation then to understand how addiction, drugs, and alcohol are a disease. The disease model of addiction is recognized by most medical associations, including the American Society of Addiction Medicine, otherwise known as ASAM. It's widely agreed that similar to diabetes, cancer, and heart disease, addiction is caused by a combination of behavioral, environmental, and biological factors, including genetics. Like commonly recognized medical diseases, if left untreated, addiction will often include or lead to mental health disorders and will become more severe, disabling, and life-threatening. According to the National Center on Addiction and Substance Abuse, addiction is defined as a complex disease of the brain and body, often chronic in nature, involving continued compulsive use of one or more substances despite serious health and social consequences. Addiction disrupts regions of the brain that are responsible for reward, motivation, learning, judgment, and memory. It damages various body systems as well as families, relationships, schools, workplaces, and neighborhoods. Like chronic medical conditions, addiction is a progressive and will become worse over time and involves a cycle of relapse. Thanks for watching. Feel free to like, comment, and share and subscribe to our channel. If you or a loved one is struggling with substance abuse, reach out today. Stay tuned for more videos.